from the speakers you hear that you must fight when yeah you cannot serve this in the european union because it will kill you three yeah. hybrid animals which one do you pick to stay alive a polar bear with the head of a rattlesnake wait i'm sorry i need to i need to back up because clearly i need the context for whatever i do i'm sorry this tomfoolery all right here get a taste of these city, riddles when he got trapped in a mysterious dungeon uh there three three ways out Only one of them was safe behind the first door a fire was raging behind the second door there was acid rain which could melt any substance within seconds behind the third door there was a huge brown bear that hadn't eaten for two years which way should so the bear's okay. dead. It's just the bear's yeah, dead, right? Yeah, it's bear's dead. He can't survive for two years. It's dead. Bear's dead. It's bear's dead. Yeah. Tommy should choose the third way. No animal can go for two years without food and survive. That's not Barely. a riddle. That's just stupid. It was a story. <laughs> Maddie, welcome to Riddles Day. A car accident happened in a tunnel. The yellow okay. car crashed into the red one. The driver of the yellow car said it had been raining so heavily he hadn't seen anything. So the accident wasn't totally his fault. But the police asked the man to stop lying and claimed it was all his fault. Why? Because it doesn't rain in the fucking tunnel. They're in a tunnel. The accident <laughs> happened in the tunnel. It couldn't be raining. <laughs> what? <laughs> they, they revealed that like... Yes, yeah, stupid. It's in the tunnel. <laughs> well, yeah, it is in the tunnel. Thanks. Um, it, is it going to be something like, you can't actually see through a keyhole, so he must have known uh, that the body was there due to oh, other reasons. Are they, are they going to say he claimed he saw through the eye hole, but he's got an eye patch, so he couldn't, even though he has two f eyes? Is that That'd what it be is? wild. That's probably what it is. I'm also going to say the real answer is um, he got arrested because he called the police. Arrested. Lennox has a bandage. Bandage? I told, I told you, dude. It's because he has a bandage. Bandage? On his eye. A bandage patch. Bandage on his right eye. But the keyhole is located in such a way that it's only possible to look inside with the right Get eye. Get out of my fucking house. What? <laughs> no. No. Esme was having a walk in the forest and got lost for about the 20th time. Hey, don't ask. Anyway. What? The, what, what is this? Did they watch my video? Do they like, I'm sorry. Did they like watch my video and walk respond the to the fact that we, we're like claiming like Esme is definitely getting lost because she's trying to see her girlfriend, so the witch, her wife happened. at this point? Evie and Kai were planning to go on a bike tour with Evie and Kai? Kai Kisuke? They're friends. Unfortunately, Evie didn't feel well, so she canceled on her <laughs> friends and asked Kai to stay with her. Oh, shit, that's Kai Kisuke. Oh my god, they added Kai Kisuke to the real videos. Better. That's Kai Kisuke. Kai to ride their bikes a bit. Just to <laughs> ride the bike, man. Detective Callum asked if the farmer had noticed anything suspicious before. The farmer replied, eh, About two weeks ago, before going to bed, I looked out of the window. I saw a man walking through the field. It was a full moon, and I could clearly see his silhouette. What? But there wasn't enough light to notice more details huh? about him. And thank the you for the resub, Threadweaver. Why? Why was he arrested? What? Why was he arrested? There should be enough light during a full moon, because the moon reflects all sorts of things. Farmer That's and his probably wife. what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Full moon Monday. The farmer said it had been a full moon two weeks before, but it's impossible. As you see, it's a full moon now. <laughs> That's right. If you misidentify them, here's, yeah, actually, chat got it right. He was arrested because he called the cops. The <laughs> That's what happens. Lying, but why? There Three you prisoners go. are sitting at the table having dinner, but one of them is wealthy. That's a pretty fine nice dinner. I don't know the one with the gold these, chain. No, Who knows? these are impossible. Watch? No, no, it's absolutely not. Gonna be that. No, what no, you're stupid. you're stupid. You're stupid. You're stupid. It's not going to be the gold. It's going to be like they're going to be like the gold chain and watch are actually fake, and the guy on the left is spending too much on food. It's actually the man eating the humble rice and egg that is uh, the rich man. <laughs> it's not the guy with the steak and the shrimps. The little tag on his shirt reveals he's a chef, and he likes to prepare a. What? How does that reveal he's a chef? What? 
But don't know me. The guy with the jewels shows that he's rich, but in prison, jewelry is basically worthless. I told you. I told you, you dumbass. Well, I told you it was gonna be the man with the humble rice and egg. You, you fuck buffoons fell for the gold what? chains and the stakes. No, it was the man with the humble rice and egg. It's the third guy. Rich people try to keep low profile in prison. <laughs> That's why he doesn't flash any valuable possessions or his. Dad. I want to kill you. <laughs> When you get in, you close the door and wait for the room to pressurize before taking off your space. Well, they didn't have a suit on when outside. When you walk in, you get a message that's... <gasps> Sus! Su Amogus! 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 Suits! Someone at the... Someone here is an Amogus. An Amogus. No! No es impostor, créanme. Amogus. Amogus. The base is an impostor. You don't have to stay in this forest forever. The riddle goes like this. Your seas without water, coasts without land, towns without This coast without sand. Coast without sand or land, which is it? Which is it? Which is it? They said land. Um, I don't care. Uh... <laughs> a map. Yeah, you're just a map. Yeah, you are a map. Yeah, map. Map. A map. Yeah. yeah. Well, you're a map. <laughs> you're a map. You're well, a map, bro. Seven dollars and the rope. Oh, and it turns out the counterfeiter buyer was a guy named David. What a troublemaker. What? <laughs> <laughs> David, you are one piece of work. It's me, David. Hello, it's David. <laughs> David, the counterfeit money boy. It's me. I love making fake and bills. I love making fake bills, fake dollars. It's me. I'm David. Maker. <laughs> this weasel has the fattest ass. I'll say it. <laughs> It's true. And he has <laughs> more than 500. I'm sorry, is this supposed to be. It, I'm sorry, is this a Shawshank Redemption bit? Yeah. I guess so. The riddle was it's the Shawshank Redemption. It's the Shawshank Redemption. What? What? There was that, you never asked anything. You never asked anything. You never. <laughs> you never asked the riddle. You forgot to ask the riddle. <laughs> you just. Did, you just did a reference and then said, "Do you get it?" <laughs> Maximus fights in the arena. That's right, it's the gladiator. <laughs> I, I need to double check that they did, in fact, never ask us. They just told us there was a counterfeiter named Dave. And the rope. Andy has crawled more than 500 yards. That's almost 20 yeah, tennis courts. Andy. Andy has crawled. It's the Shawshank Redemption. <laughs> <laughs> this is just, just the worst thing I've ever seen. <laughs> It's the Shawshank Redemption. I, I will never in my life forget. It's the Star Shawshank Redemption. <laughs> it's the ring. Okay, so this is now the bit. The new bit is just here. We're doing a scene from a movie. Do you know what it is? 
What the fuck?